And I don't know how it came about, I must have slept without a doubt. I dreamt I took the shilling that day in Mullingar. Oh, a sergeant of Grandma Free, will you swap back again with me? For my old coat and overcoat, they were warmer by far. And besides, my heart will surely break, if friends and neighbours I forsake. And where the Highland petticoat going into Mullen Yard. But the sergeant, he spoke sharp to me, you might as well content with thee. You've gone and took the shilling down at Mary Annie's bar. And as for those you leave behind, you might as well make up your mind. You've gone and put your foot in it this day in the Mullen Yard. Oh, tis then I wept with grief and pain, but all my protests were in vain. We marched through Monster Revan with the general in the car. And when we came to Wexford Town, straight to the platform we went down. And sail away for India, farewell to Mullingar. Oh, the heat was heavy overhead, we fought till nearly all were dead. From Sutt Lake to Khyber Hill till we came to Kandahar. And those Indians are a savage lot, they gave it to us hard and hot. I lost two legs by cannonball, and I sighed for Mullingar. As on the bloody ground I lay, in deep despair I could not pray. I cursed the sod I lay upon, and my joy in life did mar. Until someone near me gave a shout, I woke right up and looked about. Thank God I was only dreaming, I was back in Mullingar. I gazed about me with delight, I felt my two legs were all right. I kissed the sod I lay upon, and I thanked my lucky stars. And I swore no soldier and I would try, unless for Ireland's cause I die. King George can stick his shilling, I'm content in one yard. <laughs>